Well, there are concerns this morning after at least two synagogues were vandalized in one neighborhood. MC 5's Lisa Chavaria live for us this morning in the West Rogers Park neighborhood. So, Lisa, what are you hearing from police? Well, Michelle, Chicago police say that they are questioning a person of interest after this synagogue was vandalized and a cargo container that's near a high school not far from where we're standing also had been vandalized. Now, police confirmed that these two incidents happened yesterday afternoon on Devon Avenue here between Sacramento and Richmond. Another synagogue also on Devon had a window broken. Now, police are saying this morning that officers spoke with a witness who saw a man and kick out a side window there yesterday morning. So far, no one is in custody for that. But over at the location where we're standing, a swastika was spray painted on the backside of Free Synagogue on Devon Avenue. Alderman Deborah Silverstein says she is also looking into several other acts of vandalism, including other Jewish businesses that had their windows broken not far from where this vandalism was found. And our community is extremely, extremely upset about this. And, um, you know, I think across the world we've seen a rise on anti Semitism. And it's important that we, you know, let people know that we are not going to tolerate this. Again, Chicago police told us they were questioning a person of interest last night about the graffiti that was found here at the Free Synagogue and on a cargo container near a high school. And the alderman says that these concerns that she's been hearing, not only from the businesses, but from residents here in the area, they are planning on addressing that at a CAPS meeting that is going to be held with Chicago police. That is set to take place tomorrow night. It will be held virtually on Zoom.